That time of the year again, the Great Lakes <laughs> Brewery and 50 West are collaborating for the ultimate Ohio and Ohio beer and barbecue event. <laughs> we, we like our beer and our I'll barbecue. <laughs> Brewmasters Bobby Slattery and Brent Patterson are here this Saturday. Now, we already just told it was sold out, so I'm not going to give out the information, right? Wow. <laughs> right. Uh, you guys roll into town and sell out an event. This is what happens, though. If you don't get them on the front side, you're in trouble. But welcome. Thanks. Thank and you. And have fun for us, yeah. right? Okay, so what's going to take place this Saturday? So uh, about um, uh, six months ago, yep. we met with Great Lakes at a, at a, beer, at a beer festival in Athens, Out Ohio. Out of Cleveland. Out of Cleveland, Ohio. So over a beer, of course. All good things come over a beer. Good ideas yeah, come over they, a beer. There you go. And we were talking, the Bengals and Browns were playing on Sunday. Mm -hmm. And we said, how great would it be if we got everyone from Cleveland to come down, your chef and the brewers from Cleveland, to come down to Cincinnati and we're going to have a big a barbecue and beer fest. You know, sure. can I tell you, smart guy. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? You know how and to market a, a product. And over a beer, you sit down, you have a beer, and look what you come right. up with. Without a doubt. But now, let me ask you, you guys are young guys. Mm -hmm. I mean, you could be entrepreneurs in business and other businesses. Why beer? Uh, there's a rapid growth going on. Well, first off, we're passionate about it. Mm -hmm. um, and, and secondly, you're seeing this rapid growth throughout the industry. Uh, people are realizing it's no longer about just how cold something is, but there's a vast profile of beers. Flavors. Flavors, Flavors yes. Okay, so everyone knows I'm not a big beer drinker. Mm -hmm. And I think a lot of it, are you? I'm not, I but uh, well, here's one here. <laughs> okay. I should also say that but, I, I don't drink that much, but right. I, I love a beer from Okay, so Katie enjoys a good beer, and she knows her beer. But for me, if I, if I don't, so if I go in and I have all these, where would I even start? Like, so, what is something I would, a question I would ask, or where would I start to find that beer that's perfect for me? We always ask, what do you typically like to drink? And if it's um, a particular beer style, like, hey, when I've had a beer, I've had this kind of beer, or if, hey, I like bourbon or whiskey. She's like a whiskey sour girl. <laughs> yeah, and so we can try to find okay. Okay, something that would maybe match that flavor profile. A little lighter, yeah, a little or, sweeter, exactly. maybe. So okay, we, yes. We always err on the side of asking. Because you have lots of flavors here. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Okay. Yeah, so we have everything. We brought our home sweet home beer from 50 West. Um, that is everything that goes into a sweet <laughs> potato pie. We brewed into that beer. Okay, Katie, hey, you try that. Yeah. That's, this one right that's, here? Where, that's right there, yeah. I'm going to have a pretzel. Pie? <laughs> yeah, I already had a little sip right before we started, but you I think did? I should have another sip just And to, how was it? It's delicious. Really? Really. So you're well, going to. That's good. Yeah, you're going to get. It is a little sweet. Yeah, sweet potatoes. Sage, cinnamon, molasses all went into the beer. Perfect for this type of beer. beer. Absolutely. Yes. Perfect yeah. for Thanksgiving. Yes. Can I add a little commentary here? For me, it's a little Guinnessy okay. sweet. Yeah. So if you're a Guinness Thank drinker, you. this is a nice one. My dad loves Guinness, so I have to send him one of these. It's pretty Thank good. You, I thought you, you said, said you didn't drink beer. I, you well, I know it. a lot. I know it. I, I know it. I, now, I need something a little bit lighter. Like, you know, yeah, see, everybody's that's got this I am. wheat. I'm lighter. Everybody has these wheat flavors and all those kind of herbal flavors. Do you have anything like that? The herbal kind of flavor beer? Yeah, I, on, the, on the lighter side of things, uh -huh. I mean, our Penny Pil Pilsner out from 50 West is going to be the lightest that we have. Um, and and you're just going to stand there and point at it and <laughs> give me one what? what is this all about? Okay. There you go. So <laughs> here's the deal, Bobby. So, and Brent, and thank you for coming, by the way. And huge for you guys that you're sold out for your no, event this right. hour. I mean, what That's a great, great idea. That's awesome. Um, but people can come visit you. I mean, they can come locally. I mean, unfortunately, not Saturday and be a part of the party, but they can come and see you, yeah. taste a beer, find yeah. one that they like the best. We're open from Tuesday to Sunday at, at 50 West. Yes. Um, we're local, Great Lakes. Obviously, you can buy. Yeah, Are you guys going to partner up now and start sharing recipes and things? Or? Well, and that's the great thing about it is we actually did collaborate on a beer. Our brewmaster came down from Cleveland to work with their brewmaster on an actual uh, smoked beer, which we call an ale of two cities. So. And, you can and again, <laughs> you can be friends. Do you notice how they do it? They talk about it. They don't even point at them. Yes. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sharon, Martel, what's up with that? that? <laughs> Thank you. Let's try this one. Thank Cleveland you. and Cincinnati don't so have a reputation. This is a smoked amber. Amber. So this this is is smoke amber. You're going to get a, a hint of a smoky flavor, and it's going to pair perfect with the 600 pounds of barbecue that we're currently having. There you go. You try that. We're going to break. We'll be right back. This is never